With this video, we are going to take a look at the MuleSoft Composer Salesforce to Salesforce flow that we built out here. So what we're taking a look at is first thing is in the AEC production instance of Salesforce that we've got, we are going to trigger an account to be created in the SDO environment, whenever an account has been created or is updated. So the trigger event is on a newer updated record. It's going to select all of those fields that come with the record. And then in our additional instance of Salesforce, we are going to create that new record in real time. And we're going to pull all of these fields from that account in the first instance. And once we've done all that, what is going to happen is we have created an SDO field to capture that ID in the AEC org. So all of that ID information that is created in the SDO org will be mapped back to AEC. So let's click test. And once this starts to activate and waits for the trigger event, and then we'll go ahead and we will create our account. Perfect. So we're going to come over here and we're going to create an account for Amazon. So it's an enterprise industry would be, let's take a look. We'll do consulting employees, 120,000. And then we want to make sure that we're getting the billing information in there. And I don't believe that there's anything else here that we need to fill out. So we will click save. And so what that is going to do is kick off the process. So if we come back over here, we'll wait, you know, about 30 to 60 seconds for this triggering event to register. And once it does that, We'll take a look in our SDO sandbox to make sure that it's come over correctly. Here we can see it's processing and we should get a notification that it has been complete. So the test is finished. We have that green checkbox on all of our activities. So let's take a look at what we see. So if I come to my SDO instance and I refresh this, I can see I've got Amazon in this new org. And I'm able to see all of those fields mapped over and I get that record ID from the account in the AEC org. Very important. That's really going to act almost as an external ID here. And if I come over to Amazon and I can see the SDO account ID from that additional instance of Salesforce. So using the MuleSoft Composer, you're able to do those connections Salesforce to Salesforce extremely easily with clicks, not code.